All right, we're about to do something that I haven't done in actually like a really long time, which is crazy. We're about to go to the gym past like nine o'clock. It's actually 10.20 right now. And it's crazy because I used to go to the gym past like nine o'clock every day. I would actually just get off work at like 10 o'clock at the restaurant and just go to the gym like every other night. So I guess we're just kind of getting back to the routine. Grab the rise hoodie, the shorter shorts so I can find in my closet because we're about to go hit some legs right now. Really, I'm going to the gym trying to focus on form. I feel like my squat form has been a little off lately, so that's going to be like my main exercise. I always go through my accessory exercises. After that, with today, I'm going to be focusing on calves because I feel like I've just been kind of skipping out on calves for a long time now. We don't really need to talk about that. Instead of giving you guys like the normal run you through the leg day kind of voiceover, I'm actually going to switch it up. I'm going to talk about the competition that I plan on doing when would it be or where would it be all those little details i've kind of got some dates in my head i kind of got some ideas in my head of when i should start prep which show i should do so i'm going to run through that during the voiceover instead of talking about the usual leg day that i do but i will have all the exercises names sets and reps on the screen so if you want to go through that and do that yourself you can go ahead and do that since it is so late i think i'm gonna go ahead and take some alpha me i'm actually out of pre-workout this is all gone the kiwi stuff is all gone so all i got right now is alpha me but this is actually 125 milligrams of caffeine so i think i might take like a scoop and a half of this taking two scoops of this is probably gonna keep me up all night which is good because i plan on editing this video all night you guys already know if you're looking at my channel right now it's been a little bit since i put up a video and i got this one and i got another one coming right after this so about to get to the gym smashing legs mm -hmm. and we're gonna get into this voiceover <laughs> So I'm gonna throw up on the screen here exactly what I did in this workout today. Like I said, today I went in the gym mainly focusing on my squats, focusing on technique, focusing on depth, and just trying to remember certain cues that'll make my overall technique a little better. But if you guys wanna follow the rest of the accessory movements, they will be on the screen. As for competing in 2019, honestly, it's been like a toss up this entire time if I was even gonna compete. It was kinda of like a joke started between me, Pat, and Jeff, but it's kinda of turning into a real thing. So I've been looking at realistic show dates um, and when I should start prep. Probably gonna talk to Jeff and Pat and go over what would probably be the best approach as far as when to start prep to be like extra prepared and bring in my best physique. All the shows that I'm looking at are IMBF, WMBF shows. Ideally, I wanna go to a pro qualifier show because I know a lot of people go and they're like, oh, I'm just doing it for fun. I'm just doing it for this. Yeah, I am doing it for fun, but if I'm gonna go, I want it to be like worth something. And if there's a chance of me getting my pro card at a show, then I'm obviously going there with like a killer mentality going there to win. So not saying that I'm gonna walk into my first show winning first overall, but I'm definitely not walking in looking to lose. The three shows I'm looking at right now is the Max Hype Show. That's actually ran by some of the homies. Chris Barricat and Chris Elkins. The other show, I'm not sure. I think it's called the Hollywood Showdown. And then obviously the last show that I kind of been looking at would be the California Muscle Mayhem, which is kind of like the most hype show for me because Jeff got his pro card there. Pat's got his pro card there. I went there last year and watched uh, Kendall get his pro card there. And it was just like amazing show put together overall. So really dope to go and compete in Sacramento for that show. All of these shows will take place from like May to July. It is almost December. So like I said, I'm going to be running over with Pat and Jeff to see if I should be starting to think about prepping early if I want to be prepared for these shows and kind of going over all my options here. Next few videos, I'll be kind of updating you guys on the talks I'm having with the boys and see what the actual game plan as far as prep goes. So when it gets a little closer to showtime, I'm obviously going to be doing like a summer shredding type of series and man, it's going to be really dope to have you guys watch me go through that. So stay tuned for it. If it all pans out, this next couple months will be some pretty crazy content. I sent back the fire, tell Shawty I love her, she's still gonna act like I ain't done enough. So, I know for a fact that I don't wanna go home and make a protein shake right now. So, going to the corner store, grabbing some super cheap protein right now, and maybe a scratch off, because I feel kind of lucky tonight. Honestly, it's not that bad. It really does taste like chocolate milk. It's a little thick. It's a lot of thick. But honestly, it's gonna have to do for tonight. If you live in the States, you know what I'm talking about. But ever since that one person in like South Carolina or something like that won that like 1.6 million, I think it was actually 1.6 billion or something crazy on the lottery. 
I've been playing these scratch off tickets because I'm like, if my man is lucky, then I have to be lucky. But I know it doesn't work like that. But I'm gonna scratch these scratch offs off. And if I win, then you probably won't see any more YouTube videos for a while. I'm gonna end the video right here. It's super late right now. It's already like one o'clock. Hope this video kind of cleared up a little bit about my show plans. And I hope you guys just enjoy chilling out. If you're new, join the crew, subscribe to the channel, leave this video a like before you leave. And I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video. Personal over, yeah. Flipping it, I gotta go.